Hello guys, it's Jigsaw here. Welcome to today's video. Now today I am going to start a new series focusing on top 5 best characters from each class that we have in Injustice 2 Mobile. Now I wanted to start with the Might class because there are a bunch of Might characters and I wanted to do this video because um, you guys can get a better idea on which characters are actually worth building, which characters are the best of the best from the Might class because there are a lot of them and especially the beginners when they are going to see such a huge variety of might characters they are going to be like well i'm gonna build whatever the heck i i have at uh, the highest star level but it's not the case you can have gorilla grad silver at six stars and you can have multiverse armor supergirl at three stars and that's going to perform way better than gorilla grad that's obvious even though they are might characters they are not the same strength uh all of them let's start with number five with power girl one of the most versatile characters in the whole game she's so good overall she's a must character for every roster in injustice to mobile just because she acts uh like a silver doctor fate but with a twist because she can also be a damage dealer and uh, provide some help for you in arena if you want to use her she has the same passive that reduces the power cost per special abilities by two for your whole team so you are going to find yourself using power girl a lot a lot so if you already use your silver doctor fate the next best thing as a support is power girl obviously with the same passive but she also has that on the special one and an infinite uh, chain with the special tree so power girl is a very solid character she's also very easy to get uh and from the might class yeah she really stands out as one of the best might characters uh in injustice in mobile so highly recommend you building uh, power girl and getting her from uh leaks number four another girl multiverse armored super girl she's a total beast a total badass of a character and for arena she's mad annoying to fight against like i don't have her built but i can't deny her full potential i the only reason i didn't build her was because i got sick and tired of watching other guys play with her and if you know me you know i don't like um, very common uh, stuff I don't like uh, commonly built characters no matter how OP they are. I like to build uh, the more fun and uh, unknown characters to be more specific. But Multiverse Armor Supergirl never nevertheless it's an amazing character. For Arena she's stupid overkill. You can one shot any character in Arena with her if you have her build right. And keep in mind, this is the only character in Injustice 2 Mobile that only requires attack stat. If you want to have the most offensive build, Multiverse Armor Supergirl, the only thing you need to put on her is pure attack. Six epic attack talents and on the gears all the way attack, baby, because she gets a lot of buffs from her uh, special tree. She gets critical damage and it's going to and it's going to max her critical damage as well she gets critical chance she also gets critical damage from multiverse the flash she also gets critical chance from multiverse the flash so if you pair her with multiverse the flash as you should you don't require any other offensive stats be besides attack so she's a, an amazing character she can reach very high stats like 8k plus attack and just because of the fact that she has already maxed crit chance and crit damage if you pair her with multiverse of flash and if you upgrade her abilities right and the special one is the star of the show with dot with burning that uh, has the current defense in half but also makes uh, the opponent uh, so that they cannot resist the critical hits from the multiverse team so this works amazing on captain cold so yeah, I ran out of things to say about this character. Highly recommend. Is one of the best might characters in the whole game. Number three, one of my favorites, Justice League Superman. This bad boy is legendary for a good reason. She's hella hella versatile, man. She's um he's amazing overall. He has attack buff from pairing him with Batman. A lot of attack buff. 
Uh, if you pair him with uh, Wonder Woman in Arena, he gets uh, health. Uh, he gets max defense from his passive. He interrupts the opponent when he's trying to do a special on another teammate of yours. And he does hell of a lot uh, more damage than it says here. Uh, the special one uh, neutralizes negative effects. So it's like a clear... Uh, you, you are getting yourself clear of all the negative effects. And the super shield, uh, it's actually with a twist. Because it also heals Justice League Superman on the special block you. So it's amazing for the versatility, for survivability. And the special tree I would have loved to be... All the way armor pierce but it's burning it's different it's decent it's better than nothing so overall justice league superman a great package and one of the better uh, justice league characters and one of the best might characters in the whole game you can't get any better than this and just because of the fact that you can pair him with justice league cyborg he does insane damage per basic attacks uh, you pair him with another Batman, he does insane damage because he gets attack buff, so for solo raids, it's, it's good, it, it's very good. For normal raids, it's amazing, for arena, it's overkill, so yeah, very versatile, I highly recommend you building this character. Number two, a character that I don't have built because it requires you to pay real money real money to get the fucking gears sadly but if you do pay those 10 bucks to build this character you are going to have yourself in hands a hell of a legendary character like he's amazing he's so versatile uh he's the bare bone uh the backbone of the batman ninja team so if you want to build your batman ninja team you definitely need grad uh he also boosts legendary character because whenever you are grad the Batman Ninja team or legendary teammates land an unblockable lethal, they gain power. So you are going to have an overflow of power just by doing combo, so it's stupid uh, OP. Uh, he also does something here, he gets little chance when long on health. Um, this is just bonus stuff if you want to build him. But this one, 400% damage bonus on every 5th hit basic or, or swipe attack and your 5th hit also reduces 30% the defense and the damage uh, from the opponent which is OP man it's amazing it's so useful uh, he also has super shield whatever uh, this special one is dumb OP man if you want to build Batman Ninja Gragra as a damage dealer uh, pair him with Batman Ninja Robin uh, blind the opponent with Robin tag in Gorilla Grodd do the special one it's 2-3 million damage on the special one just because it's that OP with that damage to blind the opponents, it's it's stupid, man. It's amazing. Um, Mind Force, uh, you get healing bonus. It's decent. Um, overall, a great package. O a great package as a legendary character. So highly recommend. He also has a challenge, man. So he's not that hard to get. So amongst the might characters, he is one of the best, and it's very close to the number one spot, but. For the number one spot, I gotta give it to my boy King of Atlantis Aquaman because it's one of the most versatile characters in the whole game. Like, it's a, it's such a dumb bridge. King of Atlantis is such a dumb bridge. It's a character that, uh, ever since you start playing in Justice 2 Mobile, from day one, you should strive. Uh, getting into a league and buying King of Atlantis Aquaman shards is going to make your life so much easier. And it's it's obvious, like the best might character hands down. I don't have to explain this one too much. Like the special tree, everybody knows what he's doing. Like it's stupid OP, damage buff on hits, huge damage per basics, revives himself, power drain. So power drain on the super move, power block, uh, super move block, it's it's amazing overall. He revives himself, that special tree is just nuts. Like overall you cannot get bet uh, any better than this uh, from a might character and considering the fact that you get him from leagues, it's a no brainer that uh, arguably King of Atlantis Aquaman, it's the, better, the best might character that we have right now into the game. 
so that was my top five guys i know there are um a lot of other might characters that are great like special mentions um kudos to classic superman atlantean armor aquaman even bane even justice league aquaman they are amazing overall they are very useful for everybody's roster especially classic superman and atlantean armor aquaman when you first start the game they are a must uh but i thought this top five is just right the other is deserves their credits as well but for top five i believe these that i mentioned um, are actually the better alternative they are the best might characters that we have into the game let me know in the comment section down below what is your favorite might character that we have in injustice to mobile and the next episode i believe is going to be my favorite class arcane i love the class arcane they they are not a lot of characters but those that are, that are they are amazing man this is my favorite class i can't wait uh for the next video to talk about uh my favorite uh, arcane characters that was the video for today guys i hope you enjoyed it take care peace